Hello everyone, my name is Ankush Tiwari. So, uh, I am going to tell you how can you access the Oracle Cloud integration instance for free for the next 30 days. So, I will tell you a step, a step by step process and uh, in the description of the video I will put the, uh, the all the significant URLs and then uh, you can get the Oracle Cloud infrastructure uh, console login details and then in that we can register for the uh, Oracle Integration Cloud instance. So let's start. You can always reach out to me for any help or discussion related to Oracle Cloud uh, technology on 161 ankush 37 at gmail.com So first we will log in using this instance uh, this URL I will definitely put it into the description of the video here uh, uh, it is it says star for free sign in to oracle cloud if we drop drop down scroll it down and we can see the features it is in us then start for free we need to fill the basic details and then there would be uh, we have we have to enter the uh, mobile number and then it will send a otp once you were validate it then it will ask for the payment details so the payment details is nothing uh, it's just to validate the user so within 32 of 20, 30 to 40 seconds the whatever the amount is deducted it will be reversed for the us people it will be one dollar it will be deducted and within 15 to 20 seconds it will be reversed and for the indian people it will be 56 inr so let's start we have to enter our country I'm from India, so here in my personal email. Next, uh, so we have to choose the account type. Account type. It would be either company use or the personal use. So I'm. I have done it for personal use. So we'll go with this cloud account name. OIC. Then we have to give the reason. Reason is significant because as per the reason, different different reason, we will get the different different accesses. So then I'm I'll choose India West Mumbai. We'll give the first name an address you can give any dummy address or your actual address here I am giving one dummy address then So you have to give the hair your number so that they can validate it and it will send an OTP to your this particular number whichever you will give here. It takes a while, uh, let's say 30 seconds. So once it uh, it is going to send an OTP on my registered number, I'll verify the code and then we need to put the uh, payment details. Okay, I have received it. Perfect. So now you need to generate your password. Oh. 
Okay. Now the next would be add credit card details. So it's just written credit. I have put even the debit card details. You can put either edit, uh, credit or debit card details. And it would be just to validate that you are an actual person and uh, you have not used it recently uh, the free access once you enter your uh, credit card details so as per the country the amount would be deducted and within 30 to maximum 40 seconds it will be reversed so we need not to worry about this once we will finish the payment part then we will get the url of the uh, we will be redirect, redirected to the console so i have already registered it last night and hence i'll open it directly Yeah, so this is how it will look like now whichever uh, instance you are going to register you can see it from view all my resources uh, I can see these two instances because I have uh, registered it and that's why they are visible and active here so for Oracle integration cloud instance you have to register it by your own by going to the menu and then there is this segment called solutions and platform in that go to the application integration since it is integration thing we are talking about so we will go to the integration click on it and as you can see I have created recently just one hour ago so again I am going to go create the new integration instance just to show you which details we are going to put so you need to put the display name which is going to be used in your uh, instance URL so this is the old one i will give some unique name to this then there are uh, two type of additions you can go for the standard or enterprise i in standard there are limited offerings and in enterprise uh, we will get, get all the three offerings given by the oracle uh, bvcs uh, and uh, then uh, uh, business uh, for workflows and the third one is integration then we can click on the license type and we have to give generally we can give it three but you can choose as per uh, with, with, like it could be in between uh, 1 and 12 so it has to be lesser than 12 always so generally it is given as three once you click on create it will be created so since it is already created I'm, I did not uh, recreate it we have to click on the instance it will take a while uh, let's say 30 to 40 seconds to get it activated just after the completion of the creation then this screen we will click on service console and here we go so we have successfully registered and we have the full access of the free uh, free instance for next 30 days we will go to the integration and then there are integration connection lookups we can create our integration so that is all this is how you can get the oracle integration cloud instance for free for next 30 days and thank you and thank you so much this is my first video in my youtube channel do subscribe it and uh, share it with your friends whoever